on the Electric Energy Show, Solar Furnace Edition. Today we will be answering you guys your frequently asked questions. Okay, so the most asked question on solar furnaces is, what is a solar furnace and how does it work? Well, a solar furnace is a device that catches sunlight to produce high temperature. A solar furnace is specially made out of mirrors, a light and a current formation, ideally small mirrors. The mirrors act as a parabolic reflector, which is a device used to collect or produce high temperatures of heat that is generated and then can be used to generate electricity. Now to our second question. Why do slash wood people use a solar furnace and what are their limitations? People might choose to use a solar furnace because they like the idea of using solar energy. If you're using a solar furnace, it could generate energy that could power a home. Solar furnace collects energy is from the sun. But on rainy or cloudy days, it doesn't produce very it produces very little energy. When it comes to limitations, a solar furnace has a couple. For example, during the night, a solar furnace doesn't work because there isn't any sunlight. Also, during the day, when there is cloudy or rainy weather, it could mean that you do not have any energy or heat throughout the day because the clouds are blocking out the sunlight. Okay, so now one of our viewers asked, what can you use a solar furnace for? You can use a solar furnace to turn the heat it creates into generated electricity, which then used to power up a home, heat a house, power up items within a home. Some people make a DIY solar furnace using aluminum pop cans or screen absorbers. Here, here is an example of a DIY solar furnace or a homemade furnace. It is made out, out of aluminum cans and is coated with a black paint, which allows the heat from the solar energy to be absorbed better. And the last question is, would it be good if everyone started using solar furnaces instead of fossil fuels? Yes, it would be better if everyone started using solar energy because it would give a huge positive impact on the environment. It would help global warming, air pollution, and even decreasing the amount of carbon dioxide released into the air. Plus, solar energy is, is a renewable source of energy, unlike fossil fuels. If we use solar energy, we will not help the, only the environment but ourselves too. It has good availability, meaning all, as long as there is sunlight, we can use solar energy. Also, it has good cost. You don't need to even pay for so solar energy just for the installment. But the most important part is that it doesn't produce greenhouse gases or any type of pollution, meaning our planet doesn't have to suffer for our needs. There are many more positive things about solar energy and furnaces, but a couple of problems are that they aren't popular. Also, if there isn't any sunlight, then you won't be able to get as much energy energy to use. Hope you enjoyed our questions for today's episode. See you next time.